of the hottest shows on Broadway, the Book of Mormon. Runaway hit. The creators of South Park. You would be well advised to book your reservations now. A huge smash success spreading across the country. And now the Book of Mormon has opened in London's West End. My love for musicals came from Rodgers and Hammerstein and watching all the classics on VHS or at the local, you know, community theater. When Trey and I and Bobby started talking about Mormons, that aesthetic and that kind of, the, the choice that the church makes to make that kind of their public image seems to just fit with musical theater. The Guardian says, in reality, there are very few things you actually have to do before you die. They include, call your mom more often, recycle, see the Book of Mormon. I wanted something happy and optimistic. Let's try and make a really cool traditional musical first. It's not just cheesy singing and characters breaking into song. It's about a positive, uplifting experience. And I hope that the audience is, you know, feeling entertained. <laughs> and the Tony Award goes to the Book of Mormon. The Book of Mormon! I think the night would be a big disappointment if we didn't thank our co-writer who passed away. Mr. Joseph Smith, the founder of the Mormon religion. You did it, Joseph. You got the Tony. Ben Brantley of the New York Times says the Book of Mormon is the best musical of this century. I've never heard such roof-shaking laughter cheers Vanity Fair. Entertainment Weekly calls it the funniest musical of all time. This Book of Mormon is so good it makes me angry. <laughs>